It's that time again. Unboxing Royal Medical Center. Okay, shout out to Royal Medical Center. I just got my most recent package of my TRT therapy. Um, one quick thing, big hole in the side of the box. So FedEx, step your game up. I'm not super happy about that. Um, but everything does reasonably seem to be in order. Let's hope so. Um, let's open this up. So excited. Okay. So let's give a recap really quick before we, now nah, let's just do this. Okay, so exactly as before, let me turn it this way. I have my testosterone, HCG, HCG, and then my anastrozole. This is a pill uh, anti-estrogen, okay? They give you your syringes to draw, uh, syringe tips to re-tip with a fresh tip before injection into your glute as well as a syringe, a smaller little insulin syringe for your subcutaneous shot of your HCG. It's all here, it's all pre-mixed, couldn't be more convenient, completely timely, they track the order, so I know uh, about three days in advance it's coming, and I track it along the way, um, all the way to my doorstep. So, super convenient. That is tried and true. Uh, what is this, the fourth unboxing at this point? So time to check in, okay? We are at the 120 day plus mark of being on TRT. It's been awesome. <laughs> I don't know, these, these videos are getting uh, progressively probably more positive. Again, I always feel like I wanna just give a little context in case you haven't watched all the videos prior to this one and this is your first video. Um, I was feeling awful when I started prior to this treatment. I could not sleep at night. My hormones were way out of balance. My estrogen was up. My natural testosterone had crashed. Um, I, I was an insomniac. I was moody. My recovery was awful. All of that aligned. That's what you know led me, you know, to considering TRT. But ultimately, I sustained a serious neck injury. I broke my neck. So I started the series road to recovery, and then. Uh, after getting my blood work done and the analysis and, and learning all the things I just described, I had uh, the testosterone and the HCG pr prescribed. Um, went on that treatment and slowly but surely, month after month, about every 30 days, I made a notable, uh, it was notable, notable that meaning I could, I was sleeping better, I was feeling better, my overall well-being to me, it was noticeably improving every 30 days. By day 90, I felt like a new man. Um, ultimately, I had to go, uh, I did physical therapy for my neck. I had to get it fused. I had it fused, so I had one of the most serious surgeries you can have on a neck. Um, I rehabbed from that, and I just can't imagine this whole scenario, this whole phase, this entire season of my life without Royal Medical Center. Without TRT, I just, I, I am terrified to think of what my recovery would have been like. Um, it, it just it would have been non-existent. And it also helped keep me motivated and positive. You know, having your hormones in check is really important. Um, and while I was, you know, struggling some days at physical therapy, because I started over. Again, if you're not familiar with that series, I, I couldn't do one single push-up. Um, and then, you know, after a week, I could do a two-pound dumbbell. And then it was a five-pound and a 10-pound and so on and so on and I'm doing great and I'm feeling great and my workouts are awesome. I say all that though to say that um, that is really largely attributed to my therapy with Royal Medical Center. My consults I have with a doctor about every four weeks, we have a telemedicine appointment and we check in, we go over the new blood work. I've had it done twice. 
I've also donated blood, which was a recommendation of the physician because my I think my red blood cells were too high and we wanna make sure that uh, we keep all these things in balance and keep some homeostasis. I wanna be healthy forever, you know, and that's what they want for me too. So this is a good relationship. Um, let me know if you have questions, always leave them in the box. I try to respond as quick as possible. Uh, stay tuned, you know, uh, this is a journey I'm on. I'm feeling great. And uh, hopefully in the next video, I'll have a little bit more of an athletic announcement for you and really make somewhat of a comeback. Um, until then, hit me down below with any questions. Stay positive. Thank you very much.